for sale 1999 Sega Harley Davidson. This is the first version of the Harley game until uh, Stern got it. Uh, basically, Stern bought Sega. This was the last game Sega made. Uh, as you see, DMD fully functional, no lines, no distortion. Uh, play field is almost perfect. Uh, I will give you all the pros and cons. So everything's been clean, polished, uh, brand new LEDs. I took all the uh, old LEDs that were in it, uh, color matched them. Everything has uh, been redone. Uh, all the drop targets are there, they're not cracked. Uh, Playfield plastics. Uh, these are new, the kicker plastics. Uh, the bikes are original. They're all all together. I couldn't find anything that was missing. Uh, aprons in good shape. Uh, like I said, the, the cabinet is, except for around the flippers, which is typical. Uh, this cabinet is in awesome condition. Uh, there's very little wear. Um, there's a few spots here. It looks like a little paint. Um, you know, the translate, there's no burn spots because they put in fluorescent lights in these, so you don't have that issue. Um, on the head on this side, as you can see right here, there's a dent or a gouge. It didn't go through, but there's a mark there. On this side, you know, pretty much the same as the other. There's not much, not much wear, uh, except around, around the flippers. Now, for you who've never played Harley, that bottom flipper pops this up. Pops up for like five seconds. You can continue to do it during the game. Uh, so I did my typical uh, board rebuild, uh, reflowed all the connectors uh, around the relays, all the pins, uh, reflowed around the fuse lines, uh, reflowed and uh, rebuilt the screen controller, you know, reflowed all the connectors, new capacitors. I didn't change the big caps, these, these never go. Uh, they're they're always in good shape uh, New lithium cell You know reflowed all the, the uh, connectors on the drive board same thing with the uh, power board uh, so everything's been uh, Reflowed this thing is is good to go plug-and-play uh, the the interesting thing with this game is uh, You have the twin towers and I said this to somebody the other day that I had it. They didn't believe me. Uh, <clears throat> so this was manufactured September 11th, 1999. So uh, good commemorative game because of the manufactured date. Uh, so because of that, the rarity of the game goes up. So now here's the downsides of the game. Uh, you know, the bike's fully intact, same as the light. You have a significant amount of wear around the drop. Uh, I'm not sure what they were trying to do. I don't know what they could do. Uh, I don't even know if a cliffy protector would even reach that. Uh, so that's one problem. Uh, the other issue is the decal that was on here, uh, this insert. As you can see, there's a fair amount of marks. Is is burned off. Uh, basically, one of the transistors on the drive board, which controlled these three flashers and the one back here, were locked on. Now, if you see the bottom of the board, uh, the playfield, it's black. Uh, basically, those flashers were on solid for fair amount of time to be able to actually burn the wood on the bottom of the playfield. Um, 
They work perfectly fine now. I replaced all the transistors. This game is completely rebuilt. The only, as I said, the only thing is you have the, the wear and the drop. The, the the little splash area for the for the flashers uh, there was somewhere here uh, at some point in time this is the way I got it someone put you can see uh, a piece of mylar uh, all the way up up to here on top of the original mylar I guess it just it just wore through the mylar uh, so other than that the play field there's no other marks there's no other you know bumps and bruises, the game game plays and starts great, the shaker motor works. You're just in time for the Harley Davidson cross country tour. Let's do 10 mil. Huh. Magnet works. Red light. Like I said, the bottom flipper button, this one right here, push the bottom flipper button, the goalie comes up. Uh, show you how it works. You go up through the optics, Harley goes up, shoot it into Harley. You get another ball. In the Harley. We get another ball. As you see the flasher works, it's just that the decal is gone. Get another ball. Go in the Harley. And get your fourth ball. And you're ready to go. Harley multi ball. One more thing. The uh, the box does work. Patch collected. Not a problem. All the contacts work. The kick out works. So everything's fully functional. Uh, I actually put red flashers in there. Uh, so the game is. Uh, Ready to go. Where whoever wants it, you know. Yeah, it's got the, the three spots of wear, uh, but 3,500. We'll take it uh, because it's the manufacture date was September 11th, 1999. Uh, that is upping the value of this machine. Uh, so uh, let me know. Thanks for watching.